A day at the beach turns dangerous in Gloucester after an umbrella catches air and the pole flies into a teenage boy's arm. That boy, visiting from Florida, was rushed to the hospital. WBZ's Christina Rex is live with the story tonight and the latest on his condition from Gloucester. Christina? Yeah, Lisa and Liam, witnesses tell us it happened right here, right near the water where that umbrella went flying. We actually just spoke to a woman who works in an emergency room. She was the first person to help that 13-year-old boy, applying pressure to that wound on his shoulder until first responders could get here. Umbrella just hit the kid and we just saw him bleeding. A 13-year-old boy injured by a flying beach umbrella on a sunny summer Friday at Good Harbor Beach in Gloucester. And all I heard was like a woman scream and then the umbrella went flying. So I just went to see it and then he was on the ground just laying down like this and then his mom's like, get the lifeguard, get the lifeguard. Firefighters say the boy was impaled in his left shoulder and was bleeding badly. Bystanders had rushed to help him, applying a tourniquet and waiting for first responders. Surprisingly calm for what had, for such a rare occurrence, people were, were quite, quite calm. The umbrella flew out of place on the beach in a gust of wind, ultimately hitting the young teenager and teaching other beachgoers and witnesses an important lesson. Oh, you know what I did after that? I came back, pulled my umbrella down, and then if I left and went to the beach, my umbrella came down. And first responders, first responders, excuse me, tell us that boy's injuries are serious to his shoulder, but that he will be okay. He's at Beverly Hospital recovering. They do say this is a total freak accident and not something they typically respond to. Live in Gloucester, Christina Rex, WBZ News.